Out on the high seas, the competition for fish has become fierce. Large fleets stretching out hundreds of miles survey the oceans to meet the global demand for seafood. We've seen it happen with tuna, but now another species is in the crosshairs, squid. And squid in particular are booming throughout the world. And that uh, can be seen as a good thing, but actually this is a response to the decline of fish globally. Yes, squid. That chewy meat that's breaded, fried, and doused in marinara sauce to make calamari, it's increasingly becoming a hot commodity. And as it turns out, the race to net the cephalopod is pitting local artisanal fishers against huge multinational fleets. These industrial boats routinely go into these prohibited areas. And also as the fish populations decline off the coast, these local artisanal fishermen have to go further and further offshore, staying longer at sea, which also increases their risk. The, the fishing capacity of these local communities just doesn't compare to the fishing capacity of these industrial boats. I'm Ruxandra Guidi, and this is The Catch, a special six-part series by Foreign Policy in partnership with the Walton Family Foundation. With each episode, we'll follow the squid starting off the coast of Peru through to processing plants and eventually to your plate. We'll go out to sea and on the ground to hear how it's transformed lives and livelihoods in both positive and negative ways. We'll meet the regulators, law enforcement, and government bodies trying to protect the species. Unlike other products, if a fish comes in to the border, you can't tell on the face of it whether it's lawful or not. We'll hear how new treaties may finally protect global fishing stocks before it's too late. Hopefully we're at the right moment in time that we can actually get these global treaties over the finish line. And we'll talk to chefs and conservationists who tell us about how the choices of what we eat can make a big impact on the world we live in. These are fisheries that billions of people rely on. Join us this June for The Catch wherever you get your podcasts.